we are using the MAC-10. This is the first weapon that's been requested for me to use since I got back here on Cold War. We're also on Echelon. This is the only map I've ever dropped 70 kills on Team Deathmatch in. Like this map right here, Echelon. Think about it. Echelon, I dropped 70 kills in a Team Deathmatch. Only time it's ever happened. Definitely not mad about it. Um, not exactly a huge fan of the map as a whole for reasons like that. Um, but nonetheless, we're here. I can probably get a good gameplay here. 70 kills? Probably not. You need to be perfect if you want to get a 70. Now, let's see if this guy's camping again. Look at him. Yeah. Oh, well, I bet you thought. What I really like doing on this map is just... God. I mean, they're just camping their spawn. Simple. That's what happens. Which is why it's really surprising me I dropped as many kills as I did on this map. Ooh, good grenade. Good stuff, teammate. He's calling out. This guy kills me again. I just got to stay aggressive here. It's the only way I can kill the campers is by being aggressive. I just heard one back here, I think. No, had to have been a teammate. The only way to keep them back... He's up here. All right, so he is there. I'm on the move. I'm on the move. I'm trying to be focused. Oh, he's got ghosts. I heard him at the last second, bro. Last second. We're real close to streaks. But the only way to, for me to find success on this map, I actually have him on really good pace right now. Only way for me to find success on this map. Wow, that was really quick. He died quick. Is to be like this. Just so up close and personal with a man. It's the only way. They have a spy plane. I'm not running ghosts. I'm running dead silence. So they know where I'm at. Heard one on my right. I think I hear one up here. I just don't know if he knows I'm here. Oh, he's dead. We killed. Wait, he is up here. Brother, what are we doing? What are we doing? You're level 887, brother. I need this streak. Oh, we got a guy up here. I don't know how much a stray friend's going to do here. They all have spy planes. Yeah, I don't think uh, a stray friend's going to do much on this map in particular. There's a lot of places to hide and cover. There's a harp. That'll definitely help. Good kill. I just can't. Yeah, I mean, shit, I have 25 of the 43. So, like, I guess I can kind of see where I did really well on this map. I get it now. I just push the pace of them so hard they can't keep up. I saw one back here. They're camping again. They're all up on that rooftop there. They just spawned behind me.
I'm gonna go this way. See if we can find any campers. Close to a straight run again. I don't think it got me any kills, but. Are we behind him here? Is that what's happening? Okay. Close to heart. On a 20? Who sniped me? Can't even see who I'm shooting at. Alright, so he was there. I'm too scared to push now. I'm so close to the harp. They're all right there. I mean, I want to flank. That's a UAV. Okay. All right, I can get a nuke. I can. Got to play the cards right. I'm not going for that guy up top. I want the nuke. We're gonna, we're gonna leave him. I gotta get over here. So that's where their sentry gun is. One cow, one cow. The guy's still camping up there. Got it. I guess this is just my map, dude. Even though I don't like it that much, it just feels like I always do really well on it. I swear to God, I do. I mean, that's 63. I mean, think about it. If I don't die off rip, I'm so close to 70 again. I'm at 63 of the 70. All right, let's wrap it up. Wrap it up. You made 60 freaking seven. Very nicely done, everyone. Man, I tell you what, that game, last game was freaking fun. I am just saying it. Echelon, not a great map, but apparently. I'm just the best at it. So let's get in through our attachments. My first attachment is the agency suppressor. This is good to stay off the mini map and be super aggressive. If you're someone who needs a little more recoil control, you can go with the infantry compensator there. For the barrel, I do have the 5.3 inch extended to increase your bullet velocity by 40%. The weapon is not good at long range fights. So why increase the damage range? It's not worth it. The bullet velocity was very lackluster, though, prior to this addition. We're not sacrificing anything. There's zero cons to running this barrel. For the underbarrel, you want the field agent grip to control your recoil control. Self-explanatory. My magazine choice is the 53-round drum. You can run whatever you want there, though. And our final attachment is the Raider stock for increasing our sprint to fire speed along with aim walking speed. So here's all of the attachments on the screen. If you guys needed to pause the video and copy it down, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please.